26 minutes past seven is the time. We're talking about um, getting the food ready, Christmas dinners. How about feeding those who have been sleeping rough, those who are really, really going to appreciate a hot meal? Because there are thought to be around 280,000 homeless people in England. So lunch, company, huge difference. We can talk now to Chef Jack, Jab Sahota, who is planning to do just that in West London. Jab, thanks very much for talking to us today. I can see you're in the kitchen. What's the plan for today? Hello. Well, we're making apple, apple and berry crumble for about 100 people for the Strand of Central London being served at one o'clock today. OK, 100 people. That's a lot of, yep. lot of people to turn up. Um, is that your mum with you, I can see there? Is she going to be helping? Yeah, that's, me, that's, yeah, that's my mum. Yeah, she was helping yesterday, peeling apples and chopping apples up. And so we're all prepped up, ready to go. We've got the apples cooked in clarified butter. We've got the berries there. And we've got the apple crumble mix ready to go. And we've got Ikram Jork making vanilla cream sauce with fresh vanilla pods as well, but that's to serve with the apple crumble later on. Well, it's making me feel um, rather hungry for this, but uh, behind all of this, behind all the recipes and all, and all the detail, there is a strong reason, a good reason why you are doing this. Tell me what's prompted you to decide to feed others outside of your family. Well, I mean, since 2015, I've joined Nishkam SWAT and was it um, to help others with my cooking skills and ability it's something nice to do, you know, I've been cooking for 31 years and this is what I enjoy doing, you know, every Sunday and sometimes in Oxford on a Friday as well. What else does the organisation do to help the homeless? Oh, we do a um, healthcare s uh, system as well, we help people with um, sort of um, elderly care projects as well, you know, we send, send a lot of love out into the community and helping others that need it really, especially this time of year. Um, also, we were saying around 280,000 people are homeless. Um, what, what's the kind of overarching F message you get when these people come to have a hot meal and have some company? What, what, are, they, what are they talking to you about? Well, generally, they, you know, people just want a hot meal because a lot of people are struggling out there nowadays, you know, just to get a hot meal. So, you know, some people haven't had a hot meal for a whole week. So when we come out and serve them every, every day of the week, you know, um, they're getting a hot meal and some of the stuff we provide with clothing as well, with socks, you know, blankets and sleeping bags, it's, you know, it's essentials they need. And I suppose the stories are all so different, aren't they? I mean, no one person is obviously typical, we're all unique, but the stories as to how people have found themselves in this situation are, are, are going to touch your heart. Yeah, yeah, it's, it's, quite, it's quite disturbing seeing some people struggling, especially elderly people. And there's a lot more youngsters on the streets as well, so which is quite tough to see as well, because, you know, how are they going to get out of this circle? You know, because then they get, go on to drugs and drink as well, which is disappointing, you know, and, you know, it'd be nice if we could, you know, all help a little bit more to, to each other than people that need it. What difference do you think you, today will make to those who do come to get a hot meal and get some company? Well, well, they're going to get a nice hot apple crumble. You know, the other team are making a lasagna as well, so they get a lasagna as well today, you know, which is being made somewhere else today in another unit. And we're making crumbles. And so they get a hot meal, you know, and a, bit, a little bit of love and, a bit, you know, something to cheer them up a little bit. Because it can't be nice to be out in the streets this time of year. No. Or any time of the year. Absolutely. Well, Jav, well done. Uh, I commend you for all the hard work you're putting in and bringing some joy to people who might not have otherwise had it today. Um, Jav Sahota, thank you very much and good luck with the Christmas dinner. Okay, thank you very much. It's 7.30. Uh,